Well, it seems like Kanye West is on a tour again, but not the kind you think. He's on an apology tour, and his first stop was in our hometown of Chicago. Y'all remember when Kanye months ago made the remark that slavery was a choice? I mm-hmm. did. Yeah. yeah. Well, yeah. After dealing with months of backlash, Kanye finally decided to sit down with Kendra G on Hot 107.5 WGCI, and this is what he had to say. Mm. Serious question, though. Uh, we've known Kanye to say a lot of things. Do y'all think he's, like, sincerely remorseful and that... You, you know, could tell, like, the look on his face that, like, he feels, you know, something. Like, you know, because, like, I mean, he's never gotten as much backlash for anything mm-hmm. as he's gotten for this. I feel like now his apology is super sincere. If y'all saw his interview with Charlemagne, mm-hmm. you could really see where his mindset was. It was not that serious. So everybody was hollering about it. He was going through a mental breakdown or whatever. So if he was going through a mental breakdown, then... That means he was forgiven because he was going through a mental breakdown. Through that time, Just, yeah. At, at the time. And like with, um, what's her name? Um, Kendra G. And Kendra G. She was going through something. Because, I mean, crying and caring I, like Kanye this, was gone. There's a lot of women who really passionately feel a certain way about Kanye way, especially after his statements. We sitting right next to a I mean, Chicago you know, but... hometown hero. Brad, hell, Brad ain't cried and ain't did nothing yet. So, Brad, what's the problem? It ain't to cry about. So we can invite him to the barbecue, but he'll get the burnt frank. And, and, and we may accept this apology, but he still has an apology from the little-ass sandals he wore <laughs> some chains. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs>